Hello, hello. Well, hello. I'm being spontaneous. <laughs> Kim. Junk in her trunk. Well, hi, Lori. Well, here's the thing. <laughs> um, you know, I, um, I'm tired. Hi, purple girl. I'm tired, and I just finally got my fall stuff put like in the bins right there but now I can't put them away because my girl is home and she's taking a nap and the attic is up like in her room <laughs> that's why I'm being a little quiet which won't last I'm sure but um let me try to <laughs> well I mean I'm here to entertain I guess <laughs> let's do this that might be a little better oh mm -hmm. baby clothes <laughs> I think baby clothes are fun uh, um okay so I have oh there's my to-do list isn't that a fun thing to find at uh, 3.23 in the afternoon? I mean, yeah, because I'm so on the ball. Okay, let, let's just see. I dropped my pen. Ugh. Oh, goodness. Okay, I went to an estate sale. Um, I put away fall. Um... I forgot about Fatbird Finds Lunchtime Live, so I already apologized for that, and I'm mad at myself. Um, I don't even have hauls on here, but I should, because I still have to do a Goodwill haul. This is from yesterday's to-do list, and I have to do, well, now I'm going to do this estate sale haul, but then I have a today Goodwill haul. So I have a Goodwill haul from my store, and then I have a Goodwill store, Goodwill haul from the other store I went to again. But let's see what I got. Hey, Kelly. Hey, Mr. Stash. Let me check you guys on here. Oh, Sammy. Hey, girl. Okay, so... Here's the thing. Um, if you guys have been, you know, in some of my sales, I have someone that's been relatively new. Um, yeah, well, let's chat up. <laughs> hey, Gina. Hey, Jeannie. <laughs> um, so I um, have met, I met this, uh, her name is Lori, and she goes by second part of living on, um, on you know, on here, on YouTube. And I, she showed up at, at one of our sales, I don't know, or something. Anyhow, she's local to me. She's um, like, I'm in a suburb of Milwaukee and she's on the um, diagonal side of Milwaukee in a suburb of Milwaukee there. So um, it's a little ways, but you know, it's, it's doable. So um, we, we had gotten together to, to go, um, to a an antique mall one time and uh goodwill and then she bought some stuff for me so i had uh brought it and then also bought some stuff for me again and so um tuesday after i went to the bins went to her house and dropped that off 
and then she um, helps with, she works with an estate sale company. And so she was out like toward my end of Milwaukee the other day. And she um, was talking to me about something about that. And so then I said, hey, we'll just come over. So she did. And we went to Goodwill. That's the haul I have <laughs> back there. Oh, oh, I don't even know where it is. It's back there. <laughs> And um, then she told me about this estate sale. She sent me the link. So that started today. And I got there right when they were all getting there, like 20 to 9, because it started at 9. And it's a cold. It got cold today. It was 28 this morning. Ill. Um, luckily, it's like 35 now, which is still ill. But it's totally blue skies and sunny. So that helps. And as long as there's no white stuff, I'm good. So, I have a ton to do. A ton. Like a big old one. And, um, so, hey, <laughs> hey, Sarah. So, um, anyhow, after, I saw, I went to that estate sale, because she, that she told me about, you know, I was like, okay, they were going in. And I'm sitting in my car, I thought, well, okay, I'll wait. Because I asked her if they sign up, she goes, no, we'll just do a line. Well, the guy that runs it, you know, she's obviously friends with because she works with them. Um, he, I, I said, here's my yell, Michelle. And I'm like, me? Like, because there's so many Michelles hanging around outside that house. <laughs> there were not any other cars, I don't think. And um, I, I'm like, yeah. And he goes, come on. You know, he's like, waves me in. So I go in and I'm standing there and they're all starting to work. And he goes, go ahead and shop. And I thought he had just waved me in to, like, not be freezing cold out there until they started. But no, he's just like, go ahead and shop. So I did. Um, there were a few things that were more like my... Uh, there were a lot of things I got. <laughs> I do love you guys. Um, I There's certain things that are just too... A little higher that I can't really resale. Resell, I mean... So, and I have certain things in my own personal collection that I, you know, only need so many of, I, I think, right? Because sometimes it doesn't matter what it is. I can't get enough. <laughs> so, um, I did my shopping. I was there probably over an hour. I got a nice little discount. And I will go back on Sunday for half off day or whatever it is. <coughs> My throat just started hurting all of a sudden. That's weird. So, I'm going to show you guys what I got. Okay? In no particular order because heck if I remember. So, I got this entire box. Yeah. Oh, well, I'm here for you, Jamie. I am here for you. I am here for you. All of you. <laughs> so yeah, look at these. They are chenille. They are gorgeous, right? And I am sorry too. I would hit the sorry button, but my daughter's trying to have a nap. So <laughs> just know I'm sorry. Hey, Cindy. Junk in your trunk, what's your um, name? Even though I like saying junk. Yes, the chenille, aren't they gorge? That's okay, Sammy. Oh, okay, okay. Um, I, I often work best with quieter people because yeah, I talk a lot. <laughs> Shocker, right? <laughs> so anyhow, look at these. They're so good. They're, I mean, they're so full, you know? Look at them. Oh, look at them. I love a chenille stem. Gosh, aren't they pretty? So, yeah, and then, oh, well, looky there. I got a little bonus. I got these too. Mm. 
They are, um, well, they're paper or something. They're a, um, some form of paper, I think. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So, um, these, I will probably keep some and I will probably give Michael some. Yes, once I talk to him, it will be decided. And now in my um, former selling life locally, I have bought and sold, oh, you guys, <laughs> so many things. You know, like if somebody asks or ever asks, you know, if I have like seller's remorse, oh, thanks, Gina Marie. Yes, that I sent him some stuff already. And he's like, well, I want it. I want all the things you sent me. I'm making my own wreath. So, um, but, so I talk to him, like I show him. We, you know, we, um, Marco Polo. So I don't want to send him anything he, he doesn't want. You know, I don't want, you know, you only need so much. You can only do so much. Um, so yeah, I'm here for him. <laughs> and, um, so yeah, so, um, I found a picture recently of this one time when I had all these really super cool, like, plaid things. And now, you know, I collect those scotch tins and things and I die every time that picture comes up in my my every year you know <clears throat> and I'm like oh why did I sell all this I mean I sold so much cool stuff and I ah uh, and you know the funny thing is yeah I did mm -hmm. you know what the funny thing is I have it all written down just like I do with you guys I write everything down so I know who has what and do you know how bad I'm like I know I don't I don't write everybody I sold I I sold stuff to strangers you know but I did sell stuff to people I know and I'm like sometimes I'm like oh maybe I'll call them and see if they still have it and they don't want it anymore <laughs> I can get it back <laughs> but anyhow this is one of the things that I am so glad to get back you know in the hunt so it was four dollars um, and I would pay, yeah, I would pay more. I know I could resell this for $4. I know there's a lot of room left to resale, resell, but I needed this. Um, I wish I had a short one because the short one would fit up in there on my shelf, which by the way, it, it's expanded. I need to, um, do a few new things. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Right. I mean, I have a ton of thermoses above my, well, not a ton, but, you know, and I'm, oh, I mean, Kelly from Found Again, she just gave me a beautiful one, that holiday, oh, oh, I love it so much, it's right there, it's, it's right there, where's my, it's right there, see, behind the cherry plate, I mean, it's just sitting there for now, but, uh, anyhow. I was really happy to get this back in my life. As if it, it's the same one. <laughs> I don't care. You know what I mean, though, right? So. All right. So, okay. I collect or, well, yes, I guess it's a collection. I collect, like, department store Christmas boxes. So I got this. And you know what? Marshall Fields. If you live anywhere, like, so I'm in, you know, the Milwaukee area. And if you live anywhere near Chicago or you've ever been to Chicago at Christmas, I mean, Marshall Fields, it's not Marshall Fields anymore, but Marshall Fields was the bomb diggity. You know, it was like everybody, it was like renowned or whatever the right word is. But anyhow, when, when I get all my stuff out, oh, you'll see. So anyhow, I used this box to um, collect some things. Oh, look, it was, um, this was, this box was used for a gift from Marshall Fields and Company. Date 12, well, I don't know what day that is. 1220, I think it is. 122078, store number seven, and tells a section and a salesperson number 
and the line and how many pieces. That's cool, hey? That's I I see like something like that is so interesting to me. I mean, it's just I don't know. Like a like a touch of um connection to the past. That's what I, you know, one of the things I love about vintage and you know how much I love like finding like some kind of stuff and writing like a note or you know you guys know how I am I love like something that's kind of almost salacious you know Ooh, when that remember that one that I did and the girl said it's obviously a cry this is a cry for help remember that one oh it's like a soap opera <laughs> can't make crap up yeah Macy's yeah you know and and um and now Marshall Fields is gone and actually Macy's moved in to it uh, where Macy's, where Marshall Fields was on my side or in Milwaukee here. So, so let's look at what I got. Um, it looks like a chunk of my hair on here. It is not, I promise, um, because it's, it's not as long as my hair. Um, well, I'll have to work that out of there because it, it probably came off an angel or something that would have hair. But um, I bought some of these for re resale and some of them um, for Michael. So we'll see. But this is cute. It's made in Taiwan. It's really cute. It's See how big it is? You can tell how big it is. We had Lazarus in Columbus. Jeannie, are you in Columbus, Ohio? Or Columbus, Georgia. I didn't look at your address. I mean, I looked, but I don't remember. Yeah, like Neiman Marcus, the high society kind of, you know. But, you know. Yeah, hi, Helen. <laughs> so, okay, so this one's cute. He's a little bigger than some of those ones are. Cincinnati now, but just moved from Columbus. Okay, because I um, I have family in uh, well, my my ex's family, but they're still me. They're still family to me in um, Newark, and I'll be. I didn't get to go to my nephew's wedding a couple weeks ago that my kids went to, but I'll be going there in spring. So anyhow, there. It's so cute because he has this. Oh, I just you guys. You know, that pipe cleaner thing there. Ah, oh, that cute little candy cane. He's cute. So, yeah, he's, he's, hi, Maria. Yeah, Newark is great. Yeah, he's cute, right? Uh, okay. So, and he's even got his hook. I'm leaving it. I, I'll leave stuff like I find it. This is, um, like I resin or whatever, I don't remember. This is a cute one. Oh, I um, I'll save that. If Joanne Baber gets on here, I'll show you the next that that something, but I'll, otherwise I'll save it. I these are kind of mixed up. It's not, a lot of these are this um crap. I want to say what is this made out of? These ones that are like the homemade ones, um like salt um, dough that we used to make them when we were kids, I think. I don't know. Maybe this is not the same thing. But I don't know. It's homemade anyway. You can tell. Total throwback. I love them. Oh, and now I see something that says this was made by salt dough. That's it. Yes. I think maybe, I don't know. Oh, I know some of them, Jeannie. I've been, I go. <laughs> um, but yes, please do. Um, so this was made by C in 1980. You can kind of see it there, there you go. Yeah, I think salt though, I'm not sure, but that this that's the vibe he gives me. But look at this, you guys. He has a spaghetti hat, what? I mean, it's homemade, you guys. This is homemade. And it's got spaghetti. Huh? I've never, I've never seen a homemade thing with spaghetti on it. You know what I mean? That spaghetti hat or spaghetti trim. Uh, anyhow, look at that. It's got, he's a 
skier. Isn't he cute? I, look at his eyes. <laughs> right? Yeah, Kelly, that's what I said. Look at his eyes. He's got freckles. Yeah. Oh, my God. Yes, Gina. We, I did, too. We went camping in, you know, I live in Wisconsin. And they had arts and crafts for kids, you know. So some of these I'll have to save until I find certain other ones. But look at this one. She's got spaghetti hair. Look, she's a nurse. I mean, I'm like, oh, my God, somebody's going to die for this. Aren't they adorable? They got the hooks on it. I mean, okay. And Karen Radford needs to be on here. Because I got something for her, too, to see. Oh, my God. She's going to die. Are you on a video with someone? Yeah. I thought you were taking a nap. Yeah, I could have Oh, sorry. <laughs> Little bird. <laughs> Aren't these cute? And I got most of them. I didn't get all of them. Okay, this one was made in 1979. Look at him. He's an ice skating snowman. And do you see this? Look at this. There's like ice on his skates. Isn't that adorable? Oh my God. Okay, here's a little wooden one. He's probably Taiwan. I'm just going to guess. I'm pretty sure that's a Taiwan one. Um, okay, now. <sighs> okay. <laughs> you guys. Uh, okay, this is 1980. And, oh wait, here's one I can show separately. 1981. Aww, maybe somebody was in love or getting married. I mean, I don't know. oh, this one is a little elf. Look, it's got a little spaghetti beard. Isn't it crazy that this is homemade and they like? How, I don't even know how that's done. I'm an idiot. You know, it looks like little Jimmy's to me. You know, like, um, for... Auntie Sash, hi. They are, aren't they? Right, yes, yes. I remember making these. That's a thing. So, yeah, look at the cutie little elf. Elf and magic. <laughs> okay, now. Let's get these two out here. Where's the other one? I did not get... There were two little, I should, I should just got them all. I don't know. All of a sudden, you know, you get to that part of that point in time where you're like, how much money have I spent? That's kind of where I was. Oh, yeah. Um, And so, I don't know. I just was like, I better stop. <laughs> so, then I went in the other room and bought more again. <laughs> so, we'll see how that went. I mean, you guys, look at these. Can you believe that? Look at that. These are solid, you guys. These, like, nothing has fallen off. And they went, they are into the details. Look at these. With the, the, um, I don't want to try to bend it too much. But there, the pitchfork. Yeah. And then the little angel. And her wings are still on. Aren't they the cutest? Look at his little horns. <laughs> and there's spaghetti hair again. Now, the the devil isn't painted. I mean, isn't, um, yeah, the devil does not have a date. But she was made in 1980, so I'm going to guess that, that both of them were made in 1980. Okay? They're just adorable. Yeah. Vintage craze to Sarah. So then, yeah, so I left behind, I think, two, like, um, 
<laughs> um, like two, uh, I guess they were carolers. And then um, I think there was, there were like, there was a golfer. I guess I, I know somebody would have got it, but I don't know. And um, I, there were a couple other ones that I didn't get. But then here's the, wait, 1980. See, like, only one of them's dated then. But I'm sure they were both made in 1980. But look at that. Oh, look. Of course, she's got to be, like, cooking. And he's got his list. Are you guys on this list? Pat, Mike, Kathy, and Bill. And it's so great because you could still see it clear as day. Look at that. She's got her cookies on the little... She's got cookies on there, see? Oh, look at the, I mean, just look at her hair, you guys. Yeah, he is. And he's got his little spaghetti eyebrows. <laughs> All right, see you later, Cindy. I mean, it's just, uh, it's so good. So, Okay. Now, Karen Radford was talking about how her mom was a nun. I don't know if you guys were at the sale the other day, yesterday. She's like, yeah, I think it was, the, or was it at my, no, I think it was that. I think it was yesterday. And I'm like, how is that even possible? <laughs> we were talking about it, and then all of a sudden she said, well, her last name was nun, her maiden name. I think, or something. I don't know. Oh, Joanne. Oh, my God. Perfect timing. I got something that you are going to want. And I'm I'm showing it, and I'm like, wait, if Joanne comes on, oh, my God, you're going to die. Look, after this one, oh, perfect timing. I can't even believe. So look what I found. It's a nun. Oh, my gosh. She, gives a, she has a rosary. You guys, do you see this? Look at her. <laughs> her habit. It's so good, right? Oh my God, her little nose. It, I, I know, right? I can't, I can't believe it. I can't get over the spaghetti hair and all that. Okay, so, I mean, I'm not even kidding you, Joanne. You're gonna, like, you either need to be sitting down or having a depends on. I'm telling you right now. Are you ready? Oh, you guys, I don't even like clowns and these are cute. Look at it. I got four different ones. Four. Can you even... This one was made in 81. He <laughs> look at his wonky ears. <laughs> he's like schnuckered, right? Because his legs are going backwards. Yeah, he's uh that's how clowns are though, you know, right? They are the <laughs> Okay, so keep watching. Oh, talk about wasted. <laughs> He's the good one. Oh, look how good he is. Oh, I, I knew. I thought of Joanne right away. These aren't even going up for sale. They'll, I'll be, yeah, we'll figure it out. But <laughs> good. <laughs> Joanne, good. Me too. <laughs> look, he's so wasted. Look at his belly button. And he's got beer cans coming out of his pockets. Oh, I She's so good. And then these two, I mean, they're clowns to me. They're technically jack-in-the-boxes, but I think they're still clowns, right? Look at them. Oh, my gosh. This one, especially with that little spring. Aren't they so good? Do you still like these two, Joanne? Aren't they adorable? Yes, salt though. That's how I think. Because I was like, God, this looks familiar. And they all, like most of them, 
this, this says six, this one's 1980. This one says 1980. This one doesn't have a date. Okay, good. But sometimes it looks like when she did a pair, she did only did, yeah, definitely. She um only, no, I think it's salt dough, Joanne. Because I, I was talking about it when I came on and I was like, I think it's that dough that with salt and like, I couldn't think of the name of it. Hello, I just said salt dough, basically. But yeah, they're all, everybody was like, salt dough, oh my God, salt dough. That's how I think it, it, that's what I think this is. And they're all like from 1980 or there was a couple that were 79 that I, but these are the only ones that are clowns, Joanne. Oh my God, these four. And you know, I would not get these just because like, you know that they are for you. So I figured you'd like those. So yeah, we'll, we'll figure out a, a number. <laughs> and then there's this little stocking. Oh, there's something in the stocking. Oh my God, I wonder how old this is. <laughs> okay, well, how much how much does anyone want to pay for a 40-year-old? Um, <laughs> how much do you want to pay for a 40-year-old candy cane? <laughs> it's, it, it's an antique. It's vintage. It's vintage. <laughs> All of a sudden, I'm like, wait, what's in there? <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Are there two, or is this just that same one? <laughs> wait, that's just one, right? Yeah, okay. It's got the big hook on it. What? Yeah, you never know. No, um... Uh, Joanne, I went to a, a, an estate sale today. So, okay, so I'm going to put these back in the box real quick. Well, not real quick, but you know what I mean. So, I can't get over her cookies. Look at her little cookies. And, um, Joanne, <laughs> you got to see this, okay? These were from 1980. Look at, look at who's on um, Santa's list. Look at the last name on the list, Joanne. <laughs> Bill. <laughs> Bill's on Santa's list. I guess it's good to be on that one. And so I'm just showing it as these as I'm putting them away. Not all of them, I guess I didn't show, but just a couple I'll show. Hi, hey Lena. Hey, long time no see. Oh, you guys, these are just so good, aren't they? Little Cupid. Little nurse. Aw, she's kind of... She's kind of... Um, oh, she's got real flowers. I didn't even realize that. That's like mill mill uh, millinery. Millinery. I always have a hard time saying that word. You know what I'm talking about? Look. The... Paint the little flowers, millinery, 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 millinery. Somebody please save me and say it. But look, she's got flowers. That's just so cute. Oh, this one. This one's 1979. Oh my God, his eyes and his skates. Oh, it's that, that's the word. It is millin. It's, I just don't know how to say it. It's M-I-L-L-I-N-E-R-Y. So is it millinery? 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 Sounds like a stupid word. That's all. I know that's the darn word. I just think it sounds stupid. It shouldn't be a word because it doesn't sound right. Oh, he's so cute. And I, yeah, but there's an a Y at the end too. Millinery. But that sounds dumb. No, it's it's the the paper flowers. It's, they're millinery, millinery, millin. Bless, oh, uh, you know what? Look, we're gonna find out together. Cause I'm gonna pull it up on my, um, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. 
millinery. Let's see if I'm right. Millinery. Mil it doesn't say millinery. 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 Okay. It's millinery. See? Sounds stupid. Oh, that's women's hats. Oh, see, I am. Okay, I'm wrong. That's, and it is a milliner. Okay. Okay, where's this? What's the stupid word for the, what are, what would I call those? Like fake little flowers? Yeah. What are little, um, paper, I guess, flowers? Flowers. Called. I have a couple things of that, I think. No, oh, that's not what I want. Little. You're right. Yeah, but it's for pets now. These are. I don't know. Ah, that's not what I want to see. Oh, like vintage paper flowers. That would be maybe what I could say. Vintage paper flowers. Called. Oh, I didn't say what are. <laughs> it's not Jeopardy. What are vintage paper flowers called? Okay, they, this is somewhat of the they show me pictures. They don't give me... Okay, here. Bougainvillea? That's nuts. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I'm like... This is just... Well, I'm not... We're not doing this anymore. I'll leave you guys up to the challenge. You can also get millinery thread and millinery leaves. Okay, well, I guess that's... that. I, I was right and wrong all at the same time. Um... <laughs> But who cares? <laughs> it's like, okay, Michelle, we wasted time on that. Um, hat millinery, yeah, yeah, okay, all right. So, and then, oh, he's so cute too. Little, uh, little skier boy, guy, kid. All right, so, so again, that, and this is this cool box that I got it in the Marshall Fields box. So I don't even remember. The skier is cute, isn't he? I don't remember what else. Oh, okay. So this is made in occupied Japan, I think. Yeah, it is. And oh, there was, oh, there was something that's all cracked, but I got it. Anyway, I'm just going to keep it because I got a good, good price. Um, so this is just, you know, made in Occupied Japan. Cute. Got it for a good price, so why not? Let's get you getting that glare. I'm sorry, you're getting the glare with the, but there's the little clock. It's cute, right? Uh, so I'm wrap it back up. This is cute, I think. Look. Pretty cool, hey? It even still has the salt. And pepper. <laughs> Let me see if it says anything on the bottom. I don't see anything on the bottom. Yeah, pepper. But, yeah, I'm pretty sure somebody's going to like this. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah, do you put napkins in there? Probably, yeah. It's cute, though. I'm putting it right back in the box, in this bag, since it's still... Yeah, it's salt and pepper. This 
it's uh, the cross stitch, which I become like the queen of providing cross stitch, I guess. That's different though, I think. I've not, you know, seen this. Mm hmm. If elderly poodle is here, um, I hope she will say something. She might not be though. So this is um, Otagiri, little lacquerware. Yeah, yep. Little whacker, whack, whacker lair. Little whacker wear, whacker wear, <laughs> whacker wear. Otagiri. So. I think that's nice because, you know, um, there's a, like, you know, people that like Ojigiri and then there's people that like lacquerware and just some of the stuff just, right? Ah, oh, Auntie Sash, me too. Um, just the idea of not having like heavy glass or porcelain or, you know, ceramic stuff. Uh, I got this for somebody. <laughs> just all the pieces, you know. Um, I get this because it's cute and I'm keeping it. Um, I just love this. It matches. And there you light them. Isn't it cute? Oh, I love it. Yeah, for 75 cents. What? Oh, I'll take it all day long. So good. Oh. Um, this is not, there's a sticker on here that shouldn't be. Let me try to get that off. Crap. Let me put a sticker on here for something that isn't even. So um, then I got this because it's an ornament hanger box. So cool. Made in Taiwan. I thought it said France. I was like, what? <laughs> I got this because I had this exact one when I was a kid, even though um, this one's a little cracked and stuff. It might be the exact one. You never know. Did I get? Yes, I got up early. <laughs> I was the first one there. I got first dibs. Oh, and I, you know, did Miss Purple. Hey, Lavender. I love you, girl. I got this. Isn't that cute? These so I don't know what because I you know everybody loves everybody loves their yes that's plastic canvas I oh here's another um uh, ornament box um ornament hanger box I mean which I'm happy about um these two it's just this new obsession because aren't we all obsessed with uh, look, I just got this today because I ordered it. For, I bought it from Michael. It just came today. So we're all obsessed with these, these, um, Afghans, right? So look at this. Oh, oh my God. What? What? Mm-hmm. And me and, uh, uh, Misty and probably Rachel. <laughs> But look, isn't this good? Oh my god. Oh my gosh. I mean, so what if it looks like a boot? Because you gotta hang it like a certain way anyway. Right? I think Oh, that's cool. Yeah. I think he told me that already. Yeah. Aren't they cool, Jamie? They're just so good. And then they had the 
pom pom. This one's multicolored, and this one's red and white. They're just so good. And the good thing is, they're two different ones. You know, they're they're great. I just I saw them, and I was like, what? <laughs> Ah, uh, these little books. I got Lassie. What? Lassie. Oh. Um, they had some Popeye ones, but I didn't get them because I didn't know if you guys were going to be into, La into Popeye. We were talking all about it. Um, I, I know we were talking all about it, but I don't know. I hadn't, I have such an affinity with Lassie. I had to. Um, but I, you know, I, I'm going back Sunday, so. Yeah, tell me specifics, you guys, because sometimes it's hard when it's a, you know, there, when there's a lot of something. I got this for 50 cents because I also have one of these in a, another place in a, um, this is vintage, actually. Milwaukee, a great place on a great lake. I used to have this bumper sticker on my car. And I also have one in, like, some memory box somewhere. But, um, you know, it's my hometown. So, it's my birthplace and such. So, I got this bag of old postcards. I didn't even look at them. Um, this one, oh my god, this is a private home in Turner Falls, Oklahoma. Well, that looks pretty fantastic to me. I'll take it. Hey, Vin, oh, Katie. I got, um, you've got this, I'm sure. I had this one when I was little. And I saw it and I had to get it, even though it's all, like, cracked up and stuff. They had, um, they had... They had some records and stuff. They, um, but, um, I didn't know, you know, I need to know, like, certain things exactly what people are looking. You don't have this? Do you care if it's in, in like, kind of roached? If you don't care it, about that condition issue, then it's, yeah, yours. I'll put that in your package. Um... I, um, I feel like I'm going to sneeze. They had some Coca-Cola stuff, but it was, I think, from, like, the 80s. So I, I didn't get it because I didn't know if you'd really, you know, if you'd like that. It was, um, what were they? They were, oh, they were those tins with, like, the, um, these, these ladies or whatever. I don't remember what they're called, but it was the tins. They were in, like, a plastic I feel like I'm gonna sneeze I don't I'm trying maybe I'm stopping it I don't know but um so they were in like a little plastic bag so I felt like they were just China all the way but you know I didn't know I don't know like how far in to you know where you how the the span of time that you collect Katie so I mean I know 1980 is technically vintage but anyhow Sunday would I go again We'll see what I get. But anyhow, look at that, you guys. That's a private home. What? You get getting a glare. Let me see. That might make it better. Look at that driveway. What on earth? Oh, wait, I'm going the wrong way. What on earth? Look at that. Amazing. Ooh, these these have a great texture to them. This is a uh, Singing Tower in Peaceful Mountain Lake Sanctuary, Florida. Ooh, these are cool looking. Look at those. Hi, Andy Lamb. Lamb. They're really pretty, and they have. Ooh, wee, this one has. Um. Oh, did that one? And I missed it. No, nope, that didn't. This one has some. Um, flamingos. Everybody likes their flamingos. And. So there's quite a few from this place. And they're actually really quite lovely. This one is real pretty. Look. These are frameable for sure. I mean. Okay, and this is the Jezu 
Oh, um, church in uh, Miami, Florida. This is um, tower and carved window of San Jose Mission in San Antonio. Yeah, I didn't even look at them. I just I looked at like the how, the thickness of um, the bunch and for how much it was. I was just like, I'll just take it. Front door of San Jose Mission in San San Antonio. <laughs> Your favorite stinky bird. <laughs> this is oh, this is called cool. High Falls Stone Face. Sky Bridge and Lover's Leap from ob Observation Point in Rock City Gardens, Lookout Mountain. And then on the back it says, P.S. Highway 58 is the best road up Lookout Mountain to Rock City. You don't need a guide. So this is, um, I believe, you know, in um, in Geor like Georgia, Tennessee, Alabama, I think like where they all meet, you know, those, um, everybody's like seen those, uh, rock city. Um, <laughs> everybody's seen rock city. Um, well, they didn't write anything on these. It, and that was just like, um, typed in or whatever, but, um, Oh, there is some with writing. Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay. This one's, Entrance to Fairyland Caverns in Rock City Gardens atop Lookout Mountain. Oh, that's awesome. Here's one with writing, you guys. Yay. It's beautiful. It's the Sunken Garden in Breckenridge Park, San Antonio, Texas. Look how gorgeous that is. And you guys, I'm not kidding. The texture is so cool. Okay, and the address on here is not to the where I was, um, but it's to Milwaukee. And it's postcard, uh, postmarked San Antonio. So it says, this city is really, this city really has some of the most interesting and beautiful sights. This park is just across the street from where we are staying. Be seeing you soon, Walter and Isabel. Isn't mm, that something? You imagine to see that though? Oh yeah, yeah. So then here's another like entrance to the Rock City Gardens. And this is um Lover's Leap, that all the stuff that I said before. This one is along the San Antonio River, Venice of America. <laughs> I've always, I would love to go to San Antonio because I've heard about like the river walk and everything. And this is the last one. Oh, it's the Alamo. Can't disappoint. I am here for you. <laughs> Built in 1718. And why do I still, I know. They are very, like, different. They look like, they actually look like linen a little bit, too. Oh, yeah, I'm sure it's hot, but, you know, for a vacation. I don't know. These are, these are spectacular. I'm real pleased. I am real pleased. And like I said, I just saw the bag. I never even opened it. I didn't even look at anything past the first one. And honestly... Hardly even looked at it. I just was like, oh, okay, there's this many for a buck fifty. Um, yes, thank you very much. And if elderly poodle comes on, which would be great. This paid I paid up on this, that's for sure. Four dollars. But it's um uh, it's this little like you know, they had lotion in here, okay? But it's, but it's, um, it's sponsored by Pabst. Oh, they are called linen postcards? Yeah, then that's what those were, because they sure look like it. 
So each pillow contains just enough hand lotion for a single use. And this one had, um, it has, oh, it has a few in there. One, two, three, oh, more. Uh, four, five, I think it has. I'm going to guess that it might be all dried out. But it says, um, soft hands in seconds wherever you are. I mean, I remember these. Hey, Lori. Lori Wortley. I'm just, I'm, I went to a, an estate sale this morning, and I'm doing the haul. And I may be halfway through, I don't know. It says, tuck them into your pocket, purse, or travel case. Use them anywhere, anytime. And, you know, I mean, why wouldn't you? Um, I mean, I remember these. I'm not kidding. But I why? It's just funny to me that Pep's Blue Ribbon decided to be a sponsor on one of these. I think that I saw one for Blatt's as well. But you know what? Stranger things have happened when you live in Beer City. Ah, Dana, <laughs> Okay, this is super cool. It's made in Japan. If this is paper, I mean, I don't even, I don't even know what this. Yeah, look at that. Look. It looks like a slipper, doesn't it? I don't know what it is. They sure don't. But yeah, this is something, huh? So these are ones that are like a little different that I would have that I paid a little more for. Um, this is just this little sugar and cinnamon thing that I just thought was cute. See there, there's no yeah no it's just Where is the coin slot? Oh, you can use this as a bank now. It used to be uh, for that, and now you can use it as a bank. They think of everything. They thought of everything back in the day. Yeah, she's. I think she's an Eskimo. I'm always afraid to use that term now. Is that derogatory or is it okay to say Eskimo? I think that's that's what they are. Okay. <laughs> I got another uh, hanger box. Hello. Um... Well, I don't remember. I don't remember grabbing these. Um, well, I don't remember grabbing these two, but that doesn't mean it didn't happen. Oh, awesome, Pluta. Pluta Schnuda. So these had a, a, a little uh, bedazzling done to them. Which, by the way, you guys, I should have got it. I saw a bedazzler at the bins the other day. I know you're all yelling at me now. Especially Jamie. She's probably like, God, how did you not get it? But yeah, they're adorable. And Jen, you are awesome for paying so quick. But I am such a dork. I forgot your mug. It's, which is sitting right there. And so what I'm going to do is <laughs> um, we'll come and get them, Lori. <laughs> um, so, Jen, I'm going to um, repackage. And so you'll be billed like the, you know, that for the Stein and then the disc, the, the difference. Oh, <laughs> hi, Bo. I love that name. Ah, I love that name. 
So they're cute. Even though I don't remember getting them. <laughs> if, if she says, did you accidentally get a whatever? And I'll say, okay, yeah, then no wonder. Okay, now I know. Some, I think maybe these are made from the same company that made the Dream Pets. But I'm not sure. It's called Holiday Fair, made in Japan. And what? Okay, are you coming home for to eat or no? Okay. So I paid six dollars for this, but I am pretty certain that I'm gonna be getting something more out of this. Um, and it is made she's made in Japan, handmade in Japan. It says it on her foot, and she's got the tag on her back, like I said. She's spectacular. Look at this. Oh my what? She even got a little hole in her nylons, a little sexy sexy. Hi Laura. Right? Isn't she something? Look at her pearl necklace. Look at her. Look at her. She sure has, right? You remember that look, don't you, Jamie? I mean, <laughs> and you hang her by her head. <laughs> it's just, oh, yeah, I will. I will. Look at her. Yeah, she's good. Um, yeah. She's, I mean, look at her dress. And then this tag, it's I, its so like a dream pet tag almost. I'm not kidding. So yeah, she's something. Yeah, she's going to be, yeah, I know. <laughs> Joan Rivers <laughs> or Phyllis Diller, yes. Except prettier, you know, like the younger version. I and mean, she got the fur trim up here and down here. She's very, um, yeah, a lot of things. Puta Schnuda. Is she here? She didn't say anything yet. These two are for Michael. <laughs> Aren't they cute? Yeah. Oh, she's got, well, she doesn't have fur boots, but she's got something. So, yeah, these are for Michael. <laughs> 94 and 93. Okay. So then, Puta Schnuda, are you here? If I keep missing her, <laughs> I'll be mad at myself. Oh, Sorry, you guys. Oh, wait. Sorry. <laughs> And then when I was coming home, I saw Jermaine parked on the, you know, over here by where he parks. Because I'm like the third house from the corner. And um, I pulled up to him. I said, did I miss you? He goes, yep. And so I got home. He he hadn't done the mail, but he had already brought me a package. And that was this from Michael, my uh, Afghan. All right. And then... Oh, it's getting heavy, y'all. <laughs> oh, because I got books. Here's the best price. Oh, I didn't get anything free. Wait, what's free? I didn't get anything free. What? Who got free? 
Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh. All right. My daughter's not a fan of the ASMR. All right. I had to get this because childhood. I mean, if you guys are my age ish. <laughs> yes. Love. Well, I could just read it. I could watch it on my tablet. But it comes up in the same time. It looks like it's... Well. So anyhow, there's that. And then this. I just thought he was cute. He should probably go in this bag, though. <laughs> and this is in there. Something else came out in there. Um, oh, a raisin from the trail mix I had. <laughs> Okay, I don't know. I had to have this. It's Japan. Um, I don't know. I just had to. <laughs> so, yeah. He's a little bank. Made Japan. <laughs> Look at his hair. He still has a little bit left. Oh, okay. Um, I got this for, you can take a guess who I got this for. I don't think there's anything on the bottom. Doesn't matter. Mm-hmm. I don't think I've ever seen one this old. And she might have it. I hope not, but... The top is even thinner. It's weird. But, I mean, I saw her collection, but, you know, I can't remember all that stuff. But the lid, look at the lid. It's different. It doesn't have that, like, overhang or whatever. Like, the lid, I don't know. This is a little, a little different. I like it, though. This is the piece that I was telling you about. But it does have spaghetti and stuff, so, uh I mean, and anyhow, so it says exclusively made. For. Uh, let me reach. I'm going to have to get up. Sorry. Oh. Okay. Bloom. Bloom. Especially made for Bloom. Bloom. That's all I'm getting. But anyhow. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God, right? There's spaghetti, spaghetti, spaghetti. And he's so darn cute. So, yeah, it was cracked. Look at this horrible job. I mean, it looks like it's paint. I mean, tape. Probably could fall apart if I don't, if I'm not careful, because I'm, Peeling away some of that old glue. Better be careful. But like this whole chunk had come off apparently. So maybe I'm like, so what? You put that out. Nobody's going to notice that back there. I love that. That's so cute. <laughs> I don't know who else is going to love that. See? Mm -hmm. And the rest is books, so let's just take a look. I didn't really look at them. Um, 
So this is just a pamphlet of like the Christmas books. I mean songs. It's not a pamphlet, but you know what I mean. And it's funny because it's from a Uptown Lincoln Mercury. It makes me think of the old um, commercials when I was a kid. <laughs> when it says like where it was sponsored or whatever. Which is pretty cool. So, I am always, you know, going to be, like, now looking for Christmas, obviously. Um, but I'm also looking for Easter a lot now. So, I didn't even look inside of these books. Oh, it's got, this book belongs to Betsy Schaller. This book's in pretty good condition, though. You know where it was published. In Wisconsin. Peter Rabbit. So cute. Um. Oh. Yeah, I got this candle, too. It's a girly candle. I'm keeping this. I have never. I've never seen this one before. Oh my gosh. It is so good for Easter. Look at that. Oh, what? I've never. Isn't this so awesome? I, oh. I mean, two bucks? Are you kidding me? Heck yeah. And this is good because it still has the. Somebody tried to cross out the price number, though. But it still says girly. Oh. It's just that I just wish it didn't have um, a bunny rabbit. I think it should have a lamb instead. You know? I mean, you could tell the cross is tilted. You know? I mean... You know what I'm saying? Not getting into like a big old religious conversation. Just saying. <laughs> just saying. So then there's this. My first picture book of Christmas carols. And it's in. Um, it's in good shape. It, it's a little. I don't know. It's a, yeah, that's just the way it's supposed to be. Um, this is a Rand McNally book. 1979. This is a good book. Um, again, perfect condition. It's awesome. They're great. Yeah. Hi, Ivy Bell. And of course, Lassie. <laughs> I had to. I had to. Hooray for Lassie. Oh, and look at the little, uh, he's playing with a little dachshund. <laughs> oh, the dachshund's in the whole book, it looks like. A lot of it, anyway. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, a big shaggy dog, too, is in this one. This is from 1964. Um, look at the picture with the little... Noodle. Noodle is the dog's name. <laughs> oh, Noodle got stuck in a, you know, you know it was going to happen, right? <laughs> well, honestly, my Dachshund mystery box apparently... There was some miscommunication, but he didn't have me on the list. Now he does. And Kim from Oh My Vintage won. So I know what kind of stuff she likes. I didn't make the box yet. I'm, you know. So she's going to get some stuff she likes. I know that much. Alice in Wonderland. I know you guys are into this kind of stuff. So, like, look at the graphics. This is really good.
Really good. Really good. Now, I thought I had this book, and I might. I might have it somewhere. I gotta go through things. This is Frosty Snowman. But it's this is an estate sale. Look at the look at the graphics. So good, so good. Let me see what year this one was. This one's 1981. Copyright 1950, but 1981. I'm surprised that, oh, oh, that's a good picture. Ha! Ha 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 ha
fourth printing, 1980. Yeah, this was, I mean, I was a teenager already, so um, it's like a lot of, like, um, Christmas poems. And this one says, like, Christmas around the world and what we do in different places. And says, in Poland, we place straw under the tablecloth in memory of the stable. We also leave a vacant chair for the holy child. We never did that. <laughs> and I'm Polish. Just very cool, like, um, stories and poems in here. Uh, the Christmas treasury. And again, this one's a, probably another newer one. 1977. Um, I mean, and I say newer to me because I was or I was too grown for these. So Raggedy Ann, but some of you weren't. Still got good graphics in here. Raggedy Ann and Andy. Look at that one. That's a good one. Oh, Santa's surprise book. Yes, I love a surprise. Let me get closer. This one is, oh, copyright 1966. But this one is a fifth printing 1975. Oh, look. He's just rocking away the night before Christmas. Mm-hmm. Just chilling and like a villain. Oh, look at all the stockings he's going to have to fill. Wow. That's a lot of stockings. Look at her cute little nightcap. <laughs> Ooh, look at all this candy. Yes. That's what I, that's, that's a kitchen. Now that's a kitchen. Fully equipped. Oh, hi, Joni. Oh, he's writing letters. Oh, he made a book. Oh, look at all the elves. Look at all the elves. They're puzzled. Look, they're puzzled. Oh, and then at the end... It's just a happy little boy. And isn't that what matters most? This one is the Golden Egg Book. And this one is, um, oh, 1981. So, but I, you know, again, it's, some of these are just so good for, um, you know, like a display. This will be a good at Easter time for display. And this is Christmas, what did it say? Christmas A to Z? Christmas from A to Z. I don't remember grabbing this. Unless it was in between things. Um, I don't remember. So yeah, it's pretty cool looking. And then this is the, so this is how it looks on the outside. So it's nice. It's got, look how pretty. So that is it. Did Puda Schnuda ever come in? I never saw her. But I can show her again. You know, I could show it another time because um, she did. I didn't see her. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, well, that is it for that haul. Um, and, I mean, I have... <laughs> I have a, I have two Goodwill hauls to come, so I'll do one, uh, and then it'll come out tomorrow. Yes, good idea, good idea, Polly. And then I will do one that'll come out Sunday. And, um... I'm probably not going to leave the house on tomorrow, tomorrow, because, um, obviously, you know, yeah, but Sunday, I'm going back to the estate sale, and I'm, let's see, he's so cute, and I'm going to, um, a Goodwill, because I know that we're going to a Goodwill, we talked about it, my friend is, my friend Gina, my life my lifelong friend you guys have um met her in my in my sales actually um so i'll admit, i'll post a picture of us together and put it on facebook or i mean on um instagram and um so yeah so it's so weird i'm getting like all darked out so um anyway you guys i'm so glad that we did this i hope you guys had fun um yeah, I don't, I bet it'll come just like when everybody, like mine, whenever I get around to it. But girl, especially because it's you. Uh-uh, thanks. Thanks, Sarah. Because it's you, especially, Kim. I'm going to be like, well, now she's going to get this. Actually, Sarah bought a mystery box for me. And I'm, I'm still like, oh, I'm still like putting stuff in it. So, yeah, I mean, it's kind of fun to do that. And I didn't want to send it yet because um, I still have to, I want to put out my, um... <laughs> well, I already sent you some good stuff. So good thing I still have a few things up my sleeve. Um, But uh, uh, for Sarah's, now I... Obviously, I did it like a week or so, like a week ago from yesterday, but I'm like, oh, I'm going to get my Christmas stuff down because then I can pull some stuff out of there, possibly. And uh, I don't know. You never know. I mean, I'm just saying. I mean, did you have a favorite of those saltos or anything like that? Just just in case. Who's here? Hi, Laura. Yeah, well, I did a spontaneous haul video. I mean, everybody likes those haul videos. So I'm like, if I do a live haul and people love that, then yeah, I kill two birds with one stone. I get to talk to people and I have done my haul. <laughs> so but I still have two more hauls to do. <laughs> yeah. Good, good, good. Oh, you did? Okay. I'm going to write that down. <laughs> oh, I mean, just in just in case. Just in case. Aw, Polly, I'm so glad. Well, I am, like I said, I'm going to try to do another one that I'll get released tomorrow morning. And then the other one will get released Sunday. And then I will be shopping Sunday. And those can go out for... Monday and possibly Tuesday. Right? I mean, I could go, I could be live the whole time, all the time. At least you don't have to edit live. Yeah, well, I don't edit anyway, because look, I, you know, I'm like, I'm just too much to edit. <laughs> you get what you get with me. You guys know that. Um, I honestly, would love to do like the decorate with me kind of thing like people do and then they speed it up. But they have big houses and they have like three little totes of stuff. And I have a small house and like a dozen totes of stuff. And I mean that in I, like in all seriousness, I do. And so it takes one with you to hold things. Okay, well, my friend will be with me, but um, I... 
I did try to tape a little bit today when I went. So if I, I don't know, we'll, I, I'm trying, I'm trying. I don't even know. I thought I released a video from when I went last week with uh, Ben Minimal from with Jacqueline, but <laughs> but I can't remember if I ever released it because I I don't know. I tried to do the editing thing, you guys. I got to get the computer thing going, you know, then everything else will be easier, too. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I miss my bigger house, but, you know, it is what it is. <laughs> so, um, also, oh, my God, I found at that estate sale, you guys, there was a lot of stuff that, I mean, you know, Look, if money was no uh, no object, I would have got so much more. But when I was down in the basement, like in the icky part of a basement, you know, by the by the like man stuff, the tool stuff and what have you. <laughs> um they had this it was a shelf that was probably probably like this, maybe a little wider. And then it was probably like this. It's, I mean, probably like two feet. I don't know. Maybe two feet by three. I don't know. I'm bad with all that. Anyhow, it had like, so it's just plain. And then it had two, so it would have been like three sections. Yes. So like three, you know, shelves. And it was just plain. But in between, on the top right here, there was like a block of wood. And then on the, on the very top, over the whole thing, there were two, like, they looked, honestly, I will tell you, and it was almost like a little bit of a, oh my, Jesus Louise. It, they looked like mid-century modern, not the hairpin, like, legs, but you know, the legs that go like this and they're wood they're you know I mean they're thinner ones but they still like have that they come in and there were two of them between the top of the shelf and the like it went into the insulation and I would they were like made of wood you know I mean you know they were like uh they looked like like footstool legs or something and they were like jammed up in there and I'm like, okay, that's kind of weird. And I don't know what was what was the purpose for which, you know what I mean? So I asked the guy, and he came downstairs, and he looked at it. Because I, when I was looking, I was just, like, touching it a little bit. And I'm like, oh, like, this isn't just, like, going to come off of a shelf or off of a wall, you know, by a nail or what have you. And so I was like. Uh, he did the, you know, shook it a little bit and I think he, I think honestly, I mean, plus he's a guy. Okay. So I think that he was thinking, oh yeah, we can get this. But he said, we'll check with the homeowner. And if I can get it down, I'll give it to Lori to give to you on Sunday or whatever. Well, I'll be there Sunday. So we'll see. So if that comes through, yeah. That's, I used to always go to the basement first or the garage, but, um, in this one, they had all this vintage. Oh, first of all, I was 20 minutes there, there 20 minutes before nine anyhow, and they didn't advertise it in all the places. And, um, so, um, he was then advertising it. So it wasn't even busy. Matter of fact, I went to Goodwill afterward and I was telling a few people about it. But anyhow, if I get that shelf, I'm going to put it right here. I'm going to put my dream pets, I think, on it. That's my new collection. And um, some other things, I think, I think. Because this would be a good shelf for it. Or, or place for it, I mean. Anyway, you guys, this was fun. Very much fun. Um, I wish I could just stay here all night because I don't want to do all this stuff. But I'm going to because... Um, you know, if I get my stuff done, then I can decorate for Christmas. And I want to bring my decorations down. So I might not even finish um, all my 
um, probably won't finish all my packing, but if I did, then it would free up some space. So anyway, I know my people are very understanding, but I push it a little sometimes. <laughs> Ooh, Omar wants to send me a message, you guys. I might have to go because I need to answer Omar on Instagram. Ugh. You guys, I hate getting all those stupid messages. Hi, Jeanette. Oh, and I'm just ending. Ah. Well, make sure that you hit the, um, the little bell because I'm starting to do these spontaneous live things. And... Um, yeah, you just never know. <laughs> you never know when I'm going to come on. So, um, because if I have to do a haul anyway, I like to talk to you guys. And it's more fun to tell the stories. Um, for me, anyway. I know a lot of people are like, oh, God, cut to the chase. Well, I shouldn't say that. If those kind of people are, if I know there are those kind of people, but those aren't the kind of people that would be on my channel anyway. <laughs> Most of you guys are here because you enjoy the stories. <laughs> so, um, anyway, um, it's been a very busy time. And so I have created so much work for myself. Thankfully, I had a little bit of, yeah, I don't, yeah. <laughs> I, um, I did a very scaled back sale yesterday, even though it still went four hours. Um, but my sale, I did like 50, uh, no, like maybe 45 items. I'm not even sure. And only three didn't sell. And you know what? One of them is so awesome. I want to keep it anyway. So there. <laughs> and the other ones will sell in another sale. I know it. So um, anyway, yeah, uh, things are going pretty good. But yeah, I've got a lot of shipping to do. And I just wish I had a clear space and I could just crank it out. But um, part of the problem is I'm always like tripping over my own feet. So anyway, you guys, thanks so much for coming on. And um, yeah, well, I mean, I, I guess I tried to. Oh, good. I'm glad. That's awesome, Frenchie. Oh, where do you live? I want a Frenchie. I want to come visit your Frenchie. Um, I um thanks, Polly. Thanks for coming on for a while, and I hope you have a better night. I'm always thinking about you too. I really do. I I, I think about so many of you guys. Um oh, okay, okay. Oh, you do? I just love them. <laughs> I follow Manny the Frenchie on Instagram. <laughs> a 54-year-old woman, woman that follows a dog on Instagram. What is wrong with my life? <laughs> All right. Well, you guys, I'm going to get going. Um, if you haven't already hit that, that um, yes, isn't he just the cutest? Oh, he's adorable. <laughs> I'm always like calling, I knew you had a pug. I always, oh my gosh, let me tell you a quick story about a pug. So when we, when, when me and my ex-husband got divorced, my kids were only one and two. Okay. Bye. Love you. Um, <laughs> I, um, oh, I think I dug the pug. I feel like I have, um, my kids were one and two when, when we got divorced. And so I ended up moving from Tennessee back up here. And so I was trying to help the kids, you know, to, you know, in the transition. I forgot what Rachel got, but I got, I got Jack and I still have it in his, in, in a memory box, this little stuffed pug. And we named it Buddy. And every time we ever saw a pug, we're like, there's Buddy, there's Buddy. So he didn't like, no, it was called a pug. It was like, there's a Buddy, there's Buddy, you know. And, um, oh, we were going to get a pug. We were going to get a pug. But then when I heard all the stuff about, you know, all the respiratory problems and stuff, and I was like, oh, I probably can't afford, like, to have a dog that, you know, might need a lot of medical care. But anyway, 
I still have like a, an affection toward them. They're so adorable. But um and dachshunds I I totally love and I but now I really 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 am in love with Frenchies and uh that's if I mean, you know, of course I love my Bella. Um but if I ever if I ever had to get, an, if I ever got another dog, I know I wouldn't have to, but, and sometimes I think if I ever, I wouldn't because, you know, you want to sometimes you just have the freedom. Cause I always think, Oh, I, if I, I can't go anywhere if I have Bella. Well, um, so I don't know. I, the only thing I, I think I get would be a Frenchie, but then, you know, then all of a sudden you see a cute dog that needs to be rescued and end of story. But <laughs> I just think Frenchies are so cute and I just want to eat them up. I would love to have a little dog that I can always hold on to. <laughs> so um, anyway, um, I don't know. That's it, you guys. <sighs> oh, you want to see something that I got today also that I ordered? The Lucite Candle. What? Oh my God, I love it. It's silver on the inside. Oh, I've never had one. I just want, you guys, when I like something, I go hard. I want them all. <laughs> like, I want them like in a vessel, just, oh, I just want all of them. So anyway, <laughs> yeah. And it doesn't have a wick, but who cares? Like, who wants a wick when you're not going to ever light that? Oh, I just love it so much. So, anyway. All right, you guys. You know how I can't say goodbye? My goodbyes are like a half hour long. <laughs> Grand dog. <laughs> so, oh, hi, Martha. All right, you guys, so I guess I'm going to go and um, I guess I'll have to film it all by myself because I don't think I should make another live because it probably should be come up for tomorrow. But you too. Thanks, little pretty. And I hope that um, I hope that everybody that is putting out a um, mystery box realizes, you know, what a... a, a special person it's going to and they like do you right and don't send you a bunch of crap sorry I hope they are considerate to the individual if they know the individual and I think almost everybody does anyway you guys all right let's say goodbye if we all go together if we all hang up together don't do this where I, I say I'm gonna leave and then you don't leave and then I and then I feel bad and then oh god it's a whole thing and we don't want that Right? Love you guys so much. Thank you so much. Bye, Lori. Okay, you guys. So, on the count of three, we're going to go. Okay? Have a great night. Um, What else can I tell you? Oh, um, Real Nifty Vintage tonight. Make sure you're there. Yes. Make sure you're there at um, 7 o'clock Central, 8 o'clock Eastern. And then after that, well, it's only the best of the best. It's my besties. Fat Bird Fines. Flipping and sipping, sons. Yes, you will have the time of your life. It's amazing because they are awesome. And, you know, I think it's time I make an appearance on there. So we might need to make a, we might need to make arrangements because it's been a little while since I, Made a little, she's having a sale. She is, okay. All right. At seven Eastern, six o'clock my time. Well, I will try to, oh, that's in an hour. <laughs> I will try to check that out. Um, I didn't realize that she had, I, I thought that I, was that the channel yesterday that she, she must have beefed up her, her subscribership. That's awesome. Yay. That's great. So, um, okay then. But don't forget my friends. Do not forget Fat Bird Finds. That's an order. You must be there. Or be square. 
Oh, okay. So I'm going to say goodbye to you guys, and then I'm probably going to go talk to Laura on um, <laughs> Marco Polo. <laughs> oh, you guys, I just love you. All right, all right. Are you guys ready? All 29 of you, 28 of you, are we going to do this? Yes, we're going to do this. On the count of three, are you ready? One. Wait, how does, how does uh, she do it? Um, one. Two, I can't even do it, my fingers hurt. Three, three, <laughs> see, okay, three. All right, bye you guys, love ya.